I built a cable adapter and I have this one too because um, now I can fit LRM 400 to the, um, to the nano VNA to, to properly measure the losing and everything else. Here I have the cable. Well, it's not so easy to work with this guy, but I'll manage somehow. Yeah, here we go. I'm going to have this here and the other one into the other side. No, I don't need that. So I can go straight in here. Okay. To minimize the losings, I'm going to do the same old trick, you know, uh, middle pin. And I have a proper diameter piece of wire. And this uh, version of Nano VNA remembers the calibration, so I don't have to do it again. Yes. Input here. Oh man, these cables are so stiff. There we go. It's really, really crazy. Okay, and now let's have the other side through the adapter into the nano VNA and we already have numbers and as you can see here we have a 1.02 losing but of course consider this adapter, which is not perfect. Zero ninety eight DB. Zero eighty six. So no doubts the cable is OK. There is no doubt about that. And see the same numbers even if I'm moving the things around. Okay, so the test is very clear. It's exactly what I was trying to find. And finally, I have a certitude that the cable is fine and working good. I have to find the the other problems. Which may occur, of course. Why not as long as I'm here to tide this a little bit. Okay. So the cable is fine. That was my main concern. And now, let me check the antenna. Because I was kind of uh, surprised about the numbers here for uh, internal resistance and Okay, I need to have this solder it again. Yeah, here it's looking great. Like I said before, this antenna is a shorted antenna, short to ground. And let me see what we can measure here. 0 0.6 ohms. Okay, that's not important. I was just trying to see, uh, to check uh, about continuity and 
So don't, uh, like I said before, so don't uh, misunderstood the relation between ohms in uh, in continuity more than uh, ohms in uh, radio frequency behave. It's totally different. That should be okay. Now let me have this one down. Okay, that should be fine. Good. All right. Middle pin. And we should go to memory number six. And there we have an 148, 140, 145, oh, for 885, okay, let's go down to 868. One point thirty five SBR. 122, 115 even, if I take this up, one forty three, one forty two. Let me see if I can handle like this without touching it. One twenty one. Well, that's. An, that's a very good uh, SVR. That's a very good SVR, by the way. Okay, this is we have adapter. And now, let me connect this to the cable. Here, middle pin, okay, and we have like two point zero four. Oh, that's a mess. 179, 167, 1.66, well, it's not good at all, 170, well, it's a mess, 124 at 877, but I don't like that, no, One seventy. Okay, there is a lot of work to do with this cable and this antenna. One eighty-four. But the cable looks nice, so this a uh, this, this proves it's a good cable. You see, I got no reception, nothing. It's clear. It's uh, it's absolutely. Uh, okay, so, all right, that was about cables and checking the cables and so on, it's pretty sure this cable goes back in the service, I mean, it's the cable, this cable goes back to the roof, and uh, that's it for today, I hope it was interesting, please uh, like, please subscribe, and of course, don't forget to have fun, bye-bye.